everyone, Hannah here, welcome back to the channel. For everyone that's new, welcome. My name is Hannah, I love all things Disneyland, Fly, Star Wars, Harry Potter. Today is Thursday, May the 12th. It's the last morning in the villa, we're all packed up. Dad's just loading the car. We're gonna go and check into the Caribbean beach and then we have park pass reservations for Magic Kingdom. And I can't wait, we've been to Disney Springs already, so check out those videos before, but this is gonna be our first Disney Parks day. We've done like Universal and Kennedy and all the other stuff. Now it's Disney. Ooh, this is it! Hey, Mickey! Whoopee! There's a Disney bus with the 50th wrap on it. <gasps> Look at this! Oh no, there's a car in the way! See it through their window. We'll see it here. There it is! Ooh! We're here. Oh my goodness. Eee, now we need to check in. Oh, we need to get through security first, and then we check in. Oh, look, there's a Skyliner station. There it is. Good morning. Oh, Skyliner. So we need to go around to the front to the lobby. Jamaica. We're in the Caribbean. This is where you stayed, wasn't it? Yeah. To the left. Yeah, just down there. You can hear the rabble. <gasps> A Magic Kingdom bus. Oh, we'll be getting on there shortly, hopefully. <gasps> Riviera over the back. We are going to go have a look around there at some point as well. We've made it. It's right there. We're going to go and check in, and the sun's in my face again, I don't know where my glasses are. We're going to go in. Okay, I wasn't able to film walking in because we've got two cases each and my hands were full. We're just waiting to check in. There's tables in the lobby and they have power outlets if you need them. So we came in just down there, and now we're just waiting to be checked in. Hopefully, they're, I, if, I mean, if our rooms aren't ready, hopefully they can hold the cases for us because we want to get to Magic Kingdom. <gasps> Look! Oh my goodness! I can't wait to get to the room and put that on the telly. So our Magic Kingdom bus has Elsa on it! Oh my goodness! Oh, it's happening! Oh, let's go to the back. The best seats in the house on the bus. Ooh. We're on a Disney bus, we got the back seats. Um, we quickly checked in. I didn't really film any of that part. The room isn't ready yet, so we've given our cases to Bell Services at the front. They're going to hold those for us. And while we're waiting, we're just going to hop into Magic Kingdom, just completely relax, have a bit of a look around. We've got our magic bands done and sorted. We've got to wait for an email to say that our room is ready and then when that happens we'll probably just come back, relax in the room and then I'll probably show a bit more of the actual result. So we're at the back on the bus and Leo has just noticed there are USB chargers so if you need to charge anything up, ooh I love it. So we're just going through, we're at the Caribbean beach, we've got on the main bus depot, bus for Magic Kingdom. I think we go around all the different little island parts and then we'll leave. Uh, Riviera is out the back over there. When, so we're just going to quickly nip into Magic Kingdom, probably have a bite to eat, have a look around, kind of activate the bands. Oh, Skyliner Station. That's the main hub, so you can go that way to Hollywood Studios or that way to Epcot and that way to uh, Art of Animation and Pop Century. Oh, you can see some of the pods coming in. So yeah, quick relax in Magic Kingdom, probably have a bite to eat, have a walk around, see the castle, and then, ooh, look it goes. We should get an email when our room is ready, so we'll then come back, get our bags, I'll do a room tour, and at some point I'll show you the resort as well. I did see some 50th items in the gift shop, so you know I'm going to go in there. Just coming up on the Magic Kingdom entrance, you'll probably just see it through there. Oh no, the trees! Well, there's the, oh, there it is! Look! Return service to your resort is available in this section. Be sure to ask your driver for the exact location. Smoking is not worried at night. Except 
except in the designated area outside the park entrance. Please collect your belongings, watch your head, and set if you disembark. Take small children by the hand and follow the walkway from the entrance. As you approach the entrance, please keep your party together. Thanks for riding with us, and have a wonderful time here at the Magic Kingdom. We're off the bus. Oh, it's happening! Look at all the 50th signs everywhere. Oh my goodness. Oh, it feels like it's been too long. The world's most magical celebration. Oh, I am so ready for this. Just got off the bus. Oh. Security actually looks quite empty, so security should be a breeze. Our magic bands are sorted. So hopefully in a few moments, we should be in the park. Look, here it is. Security was a breeze. You, they just get you to walk through one of those scanner things. If it beeps, you go get your bags checked. If it doesn't beep, you're straight on through. Oh, look. It's finally happening. Oh, now we've been told our bands are set up. We'll find out, won't we? This could all go horribly wrong. Oh, magic. And Leo's through too, perfect. Oh, goodness. I'm getting a little bit emotional. Oh, we're in, we're through. We're gonna walk down Main Street USA. I'm gonna film the castle, not me, because you don't wanna see that. Oh my goodness. There's a lot of people kind of sat about, so I think we might have, oh yeah, there's ropes. So it looks like there might be a parade soon. <gasps> and there you can meet Mickey Mouse. You can hug Mickey Mouse. I think we can still walk down Main Street by the look of it, people are still doing that. So I'm not sure what time the parade is. We haven't got any times of anything. We just want to see the castle for a bit, to be honest. We might have a quick walk through the Emporium later as well. We've got a proper full Magic Kingdom day coming up. This is just as a, holy moly, oh my goodness, look at that. Oh my word. Okay. Yeah, I'm a bit speechless. She's beautiful. She's even more beautiful than I remembered. Oh, I think I need a minute. Look. Isn't she beautiful? Okay, so we're going to nip into the shop real quick because they're directing people kind of off Main Street, so there must be a parade. So I think we'll nip into a shop. I mean, why not? Spend some coin. And then we'll try and get up to the castle. Ooh, into the Emporium. <gasps> oh, look at this. Can we just take this big castle home, please? I'm sure we can fit that on the plane. Oh wow, I think this is just all 50th stuff right here. Oh, she's breathing fire! Oh my goodness me. Oh look, look at the castle. We're just waiting for the parade to finish and then we can hopefully try and get a bit closer. Look who it is! It's Mickey and Minnie! Look at their outfits! Oh, they are so adorable! I love Minnie's outfit. Hi, Minnie! I'm now they're behind a tree! Go away, tree! Oh my goodness, look! They are just so adorable! Just look at the castle. Isn't she beautiful? Oh, you can never get tired of this view. They've currently got the castle closed at the moment, so you can't walk through. I think they're setting up for a little show. So we're going to go to our favourite bathrooms, which are the Tangled ones. The castle! We just had... Yeah, I normally go and run up and touch the castle. I'll do that later. 
we just had some photo pass pictures put in in the castle so hopefully at least one turned out okay and i'll pop that in Ooh. okay so we're in Fantasyland. we are gonna nip to the tangled area real quick and then i think we're gonna get a snack because we're getting rather hungry this is an idea of the crowd level it's half past 12 i think it's about half past 12 and it is a thursday thursday may the 12th haven't actually looked at any of the wait times just yet we'll have a quick check of those in a second because that will probably give you an even better indication of crowd level although it got very very busy around Main Street USA for the parade but then it did clear out quite quickly what's the way oh Mickey's Feel Our Magic is more of a show that's not necessarily like a proper indication of wait time so we'll check oh is Peter Pan down here that's normally a good indication actually Ooh, gift shops. Now I've already seen a couple things I want, but I don't want to carry them around with me. So we're going to get things on the way out because there are a lot of them. Normally, if you see something you want and there's only a couple of them, grab it right there and then because it might be gone. The, these were just like keychains and magnets, that sort of thing. So there's plenty of those. So no need to panic. Okay, have a guess. What do we think the wait time is for Peter Pan? can't see it yet oh i can't see it yet oh there's a zero on the end 40 40 minutes that's not bad actually for peter pan 40 minute wait oh tangled section best bathrooms ever apparently as well i think there are oh, maybe 10 hidden pascals in this area I've never found all of them. There are obviously videos and websites that you can go to that will tell you exactly where they are. But I think there are 10 tiny little hidden Pascals. So if you want a little activity to do, you can look out for them. Oh, look. Look at that tangled tower up there. I'll zoom in a little bit. Oh, love it. Love it. Love it. So we've just been to the Tangle bathrooms. We're gonna go and see if we can get on the People Mover. We just want a really relaxed day today. So People Mover, you can just sit on there, have a nice view, and we can see the Tron construction, which unfortunately isn't gonna be open when we're here, but never mind. Tomorrow land, the land of tomorrow. Okay, so we're gonna try and get on the People Mover. I can see it running there. Oh, I can smell popcorn as well. Oh my goodness, Disney popcorn. Can you beat it? There's a little bird landed. Oh, he's gone. Going on the people mover. Oh, and the cast member just said she loved my ears. I've got the tangled ears on, you've probably seen them. Oh, people mover. This is an amazing ride to do if you just need a bit of a relax, you need to cool down, you just want to see the park very nice relaxing ride this one she basically just sit in there and that's the speed that it goes and it's also going to take us past tron so we'll have a look at that as well there we go say hi to leo oh you're gonna sit this way hello look space mountain I just knocked my ears off my head and they very nearly went over the side. So hold on to your ears. Whee! Oh, Stitch is down there. Can we see Stitch? There he is. Hi, Stitch. Oh, I can smell popcorn again. Oh, yeah, we are definitely going for food after this. We're hungry. Oh, they have good stuff in there. We'll go in that shop later. This is such a nice ride to just sit on and relax. It's majority in the shade. You get a beautiful breeze coming through. You get to watch people. It's called the people. Oh, look at that crowd. Oh my goodness. And you get the perfect view of the castle in a moment as we go around the corner. Are you ready? Are you ready? 
there she is. She's so beautiful. She's so fancy. Bye, Castle. Ooh, oh. So that's what Walt wanted for Epcot. He wanted an actual city where you could live and work. And that was the birth of Epcot. Oh no, the robot's tired. He's asleep. Where you'll find the greatest gifts from around your galaxy. Gift shop! Yay! Speedway. At you can drive on there even if you don't have a license. Pedal to the metal and speed towards the checkered flag in your very own race car. Young or old, this is your chance to drive in the fast lane without worrying about getting a speeding ticket. Oh, look, here's the Tron construction. Oh, no. We're not going to be able to ride it this trip. But I cannot wait to ride it. Wow, they are doing a lot. Oh, you can see the track under that big canopy. Oh, my word. I want to zoom out. Look at this. Can't wait to go on Tron. Space Mountain. Oh, I can hear people screaming. Blast off on a high speed outer space adventure and quickly do the cosmos. Oh, we've slowed down a bit. Spaceman! Right now it is absolutely pitch black. We are still moving but I can't see a thing and I can't hear a thing. Actually no, I can hear people screaming from Space Mountain. But I can't see a thing. Oh, this is eerie. I don't even see any light. Where's the light? Where's the way out? This is actually very surreal. It's completely and utterly pitch black. No lights at all. Oh, this is very odd. It's a little bit scary. Oh, oh, we're being moved. Oh, 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 oh. There's lights on the ceiling. You probably can't see those. This is so eerie. Oh my goodness. Oh, there we go. There's the exit. Well, that was a little bit worrying. Oh my word, that seems very bright now. Holy moly. From sitting in that pitch black for a while to then going into this. Ooh. Oh, and there's Tron again right ahead. I'll zoom out real quick so you can try and see Tron. Look! There's a castle! Ooh, construction going on. Adventure. Hop on board the Astro Orbiter. Pilot your own 
Oh, we've gone to a stop. We're going backwards? Are we supposed to go backwards? For a different high flying adventure, oh, no. the Astro Orbiter. Pilot your own spacecraft. Okay, you now we're at a stop. And ascend to otherworldly heights. We're stuck. We're stuck on the people mover. But you can see Tron just there. Oh, I can't wait to see it finished. Gift shop! Okay, we don't know what's happening, but there's cast members walking across all the tracks right now. So I don't know if something... Oh, they're getting people to get off? Oh no! Well, this might end badly for us because we're kind of here. There's nowhere for us to get off. Ooh! This is the first time this has ever happened to us. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of loving it because it's a little bit of drama! So while we're waiting to be evacuated, there's some fireworks! And I think a cast member has just got the people off that train and they're walking into that building. So we're stuck. Okay, we're getting off. We're getting off the people mover. Oh my goodness, a cast member's just told us to follow her down there. This is where we're walking. Oh, I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little bit scared. Oh my goodness, something's, ha something's definitely happened. We're definitely stuck. Because that's like backstage. Oh goodness. I mean if you don't like heights you're a little bit stuck. Ooh, look at the tracks. Oh no. Well, I mean normally the people mover is a very relaxing, very enjoyable ride. And you never know. You might get to be evacuated off there. But this is kind of fun, I think. Oh, I mean, it's an experience, let's put it that way. This is probably never going to happen to us again, so yay! Fun! Ooh, another good look at Tron, though. Oh, I can't wait to go on Tron when it's open. I mean, the cast members are all being amazing. I'd have to say they've kind of got everything under control, so this has probably happened before. Ooh, we're getting an extra look, though. Oh my goodness. So you can see the track goes under there and from what I've seen online and all that kind of stuff, I think it, there's either one in Shanghai or Tokyo, I can't remember right now which one. But you, it's like you're sitting on a bike and you travel through, like on the, is it the light cycles? Oh, we have to step exactly on there. Okay, this might be difficult. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Right, they're just going in through and checking all the doors. Do you know what though? If we were a couple minutes earlier, imagine being in the pitch dark when that happens. I mean, I'd imagine they would kind of put the lights on, you would hope. Sorry about that, Cast members just said their emergency alarm came on, so as a precaution, they get everyone off. Yeah, it could be anything. It could be construction on Tron, construction on this building. Who knows? But as, an, as a precaution, they don't take any chances. So, I mean, we're more than happy to get off if there is a safety issue. Ooh, that was exciting. Now we're back! Well, we were up there. Have I got my, oh yeah, my ears are on. I was just about to say my ears, but I've got them on my head. After I nearly knocked them off earlier. Woo! What an adventure! So we've just done a mobile order in Starlight Ray's Cafe. First time we've done a mobile order. There was availability right away, so we've done it. We've said that we're here and it's preparing our food. So we came up to the counter. Look at this. Picked Thank up you. our order. I'll grab this. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you. I'll grab the drink. Okay, so now we go get condiments. Look at this cup. We literally waited, what, three minutes? Oh, and now we go find a table. 
Okay, so we found a seat. I did not realise this hot dog was that big. That's going to be a struggle. That came with fries. Leo had a burger, again came with fries. I think he got a honey mustard and I got a barbecue for the fries. Look at these cups. I mean, I wish I could buy this cup. We found Stitch right next to the purple wall. Now to find the others. So just in the Tomorrowland Terrace, this is where they tend to do the dessert parties, just in there and in there. And then the castle is just through there. We did one of these dessert parties on our last trip. So we watched the fireworks from the hub just through there. And then we came and sat in here for, for the dessert. And all of that was full of desserts, a chocolatey sweetness. It was absolutely amazing. So we've just left Magic Kingdom for the day. Our resort room is ready. It's 3 p.m. right now. It, well, it's been ready for a couple of hours, but we just wanted to stay in Magic Kingdom for a bit. We've also sorted out the DAS Pass. I've got multiple medical issues that qualify for DAS, so I'll go over that when we get back to the resort. And she showed me in there how to request it through the app now. It used to be that you had to go up to a cast member at the ride, request a return time. You can do it through the app now, so I'll try and get like a screen grab of in the app or something like that. So now we need to find, because I can't remember where the bus dropped us, so now we need to find the bus back to the resort. We are back at the Caribbean beach. We're going to go to Bell Services, tell them our room is ready, have a real quick look kind of in the foyer, in the gift shop, so I'll show you some of that, and then make our way to our room. Okay, so this is the some of, some of the bit that I wasn't able to show earlier because I didn't have any hands free. So this is the main foyer. Look at this as you walk in. Disney 50th. Ooh, and it, the smell. I don't know what that smell is. If they sell it, I want it. So as soon as you come in, over to the left is where you check in. That's over to kind of the other islands and the shop is over here. So if we have a little peruse of the shop. Cause you know, can you ever spend enough when you're in Disney? I'm just gonna say no, you can't. 50th items as soon as you walk in. Now you can get a lot of these in the parks. Oh, chocolate. Oh no. Well, that might melt in this heat. Oh, coffee. We've not actually seen any of this anywhere else just yet. The Joffrey's coffee, the 50th anniversary blend. Now it says it's a dark ground coffee. Oh, I'm not a huge coffee person, so I don't really know much of what that means. Is there a price anywhere? I don't what? see a price, but it's Joffrey's mm -hmm. coffee. Leo's saying he wants the beans because he's got a fancy coffee maker at home that you kind of put the beans in the top and then it does all that magical stuff for you. What is that? Oh, that's, what's that word? Lenticular. Postcard. Postcard. What is, oh, it's a four puzzle set and then a thousand piece puzzle and another thousand piece puzzle. Do we have any prices? Okay, so that one is $24.99. Oh... Oh, there's Pandora charms. <gasps> Skyliner stuff. Now, I've been told in Epcot there's um, a popcorn bucket of the Skyliner, one of the pods, and it's like a big yellow popcorn bucket. I intend on getting that. How much is the mug? 19.99 for the mug. Oh, look. Chippendale, they're so stinking cute. Oh, luggage tag. Oh, ID holder. See, if there was a luggage tag, I might get one, because the ones that we have now, they're a little bit old and battered. Main Street stuff in here that was unexpected. I just love backpacks. I think a lot of these clothes. Oh, Caribbean beach clothes. Right, I'm gonna get something. What it is, I don't know. Oh, the H2O stuff. Now, when we went on the Disney cruise and we've been here before, the sea salt stuff is absolutely amazing. So, I'm hoping they have some of this in the room. Oh, there's a tester. Oh, yep, I can verify. I've just given that a whiff and it's beautiful oh i like these shorts Are these kind of they're kind of like biker shorts in a way 36.99 they're nice they're very nice well, I'll have a look at the pandora stuff in a second oh this is nice that's like a little christmas figure 29.99 oh do we have Loungefly Caribbean Beach Resort ears. Did you hear Leo exclaim in the background? He knows I'm gonna get those. <laughs> I can't help myself. 
Ooh, now we've seen that one in Disney Springs. I've not seen the shorts before. They're nice. How much are you? $59.99. They are nice. They have Alex and Arnie bangles. I have a few of those at home. I should wear them more, really. Ooh, they've got some knickknacks over there. So if you want any refreshments, there's sweets. I will go over there in a sec. Ears as well. If you would like to buy yourself any ears. Lanyards and pins. I wonder if there's a Caribbean Beach specific pin. These just 50th pins. I think those ones are just for the 50th. Oh, here we go. Here's some more pins. So is there a specific Caribbean Beach pin? Not on that side. Let's have a spinny round. Uh, I don't see one on that side. What's this actually? Oh, Skyliner. That's a Skyliner pin. Oh, look. I like that Pascal pin. He might come home with me. Just saying. Oh, I thought that was all of Ariel's sisters then. I saw Triton and Colours. I'm obsessed with things with Ariel and all of her sisters on there. Okay, so I can't see any just specific Caribbean beach pins, but there's time. A plushy wall. Little notebooks, autograph books, and pens if you need those. It's also a Mickey plush, he's so cute. Snackies. Okay, so you've got all the 50th Coke products up there. Oh, there's milk. Right, we need some milk in a bit. There we go, off to get the milk. Ooh, are these candles? What's this? Oh, oh. It is Castle Candle. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's heavy. 34 99 That's really heavy. We'll put that back because I don't want to drop it. Crispy treats. And tea, if you would like any tea. Unbirthday cake blend. Now, what's the price difference? I, I don't know about prices with that. It's not 100% clear. Some home items as well. Oh, they've got an orange bread cup. And then some luggage in case you need your luggage. So we've just purchased our resort refillable mugs. We've got a different one each. And we're walking around by the Riviera because last time we came, this opened up like the week after we left so we're not gonna go in properly today we just wanted to walk around because we're in Aruba in the Caribbean Beach which is kind of the building pretty much next to Riviera so we figured we'd have a little walk and have a look at this beautiful building because actually last time we came we did one of those DVC talks we were so close we to rooms. being we did actually yeah we toured the rooms here we were so close to being DVC at Riviera. I mean, if you weigh the options up, we ended up moving house to a much better, nicer location. So it was either moving house or DVC. Being stood here right now, I wish it was DVC, but when we get home, I'll be glad that we moved instead. But either way, this resort just looks beautiful. We probably will nip in there at some point, just not right now. I'm actually looking for the Rapunzel Muriel, Muriel, oh I've done it again. I keep saying Muriel instead of mural. Look at this, it's so beautiful. You can see why I want to find the Rapunzel, mural. Why do I keep calling it a Muriel? It's just stuck in my head. So I think there's a helicopter somewhere. Oh, I think it's through an archway just over there. And again, I should just put my sunglasses on, shouldn't I? We found it, here it is. Oh my goodness. So there's a Rapunzel one on this side closest to us now. And it starts on the one side and goes completely over. And then there's a Peter Pan one on the other side. Oh wow. Look at this. So it starts there. And then it goes all the way up here. And then it goes down that side to the Tangled Tower. So beautiful. Oh, off the Skyliner goes. Oh, there's a 50th one there. I think, actually, that 50 one is pretty much the Epcorn, Epcorn, Popcorn, Epcot, Popcorn Bucket. Goodness me. Oh, we'll be going on there tomorrow. Tomorrow is a Hollywood Studios day. 
where I'm doing a full Ahsoka bound and we're building a lightsaber. Ooh. So make sure to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell for that one. So I'll be showing as much as I can of that. Oh, this next one is ours. Here we are, all the fives. So we've just come into the room. We're in the Caribbean beach, Aruba. This is five, 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 five. So all the fives. There are two big queen size beds. A huge bit of room here, probably for the luggage. And then a little shelf there for bits and bobs. Hang up your jackets, put your wallets. There's a beautiful ceiling fan up there. Lights there. I think the aircon is in this very corner. It's We've put that on. Oh, look. Yeah, that's coming with me. Enhanced cleaning, so it shows you what they've cleaned. We did opt for kind of like clean towels and the trash removing every other day. You can opt to have it not done at all. Hello, Mira Hannah. So let's have a look in these. I would presume these are storage. Oh, extra pillow in that top one. What's in the bottom one? So yeah, big storage in there. And I think this is a pull down bed. I'm not gonna mess with that though. Just in case, I know what I'm like. So there's more storage in all these three bottom drawers. What's in this? Oh, I think Leah's gonna pull the bed down. Aha, there's the fridge. We do like a good fridge. Oh look! Shall I just, okay, I'm just gonna let that go down. So this is kind of the spare little Murphy bed. Look at this beautiful Mickey and Pluto in there. You have to have Walt Disney World on the television. I did turn it down though, we don't want copywriting. So today is Thursday, May 12th, that's the time. There's a little section over here for some drinks. They've got a coffee maker with some of the Joffrey's 50th blend. It just says dark roast, like it doesn't really give an indication as to, I don't think it tells you what sort of flavour it is, like if it's caramelly or all that kind of stuff. You've got some Twinings tea, got some coffee mate there. Oh, there's some USB plugs at the very back over there. Quickly into the bathroom. Ironing board, iron, extra towels, extra towels, extra blanket and pillow. There's some bins down there. Towels and hair dryer these beautiful things which are coming home with us hello oh these sorts of taps oh ooh, that's nice little makeup towels now i love these makeup mirrors there's a really magnified side but you can kind of pull those out a bit from the wall to use as you need and into the toilet there is a full length mirror on the toilet door toilet plenty of towels lovely shower there and then they have the H2O stuff, but it's in, like, they're not doing the re, what do you call it, the reusable plastic, no, this is reusable plastic, I have completely lost my words. So they put it in these refillable things now, and you can just use them from there, they used to give you little bottles, but that was obviously a lot of single-use plastic. So we'll check, oh, he's having a mooch. So, what do we have plug-wise around the bed? So there's some plugs down there. Now, if you're coming from abroad, the best thing that we do, which we learned a couple of years ago, instead of having to bring like four or five adapters, if you just bring one single adapter and an extension lead, then you can use all your UK, for example, plugs with just one adapter. So over here, there's the telephone and a couple plugs there and two USBs. Uh, which ones do these do? Oh, okay, that one's the ceiling fan. That one is for that light. So I'm presuming this one is for that one. Lovely. Oh, these pillows. <gasps> this bed feels amazing. So do you know what? Ah, this is really nice. Oh, so comfortable. <sighs> so we called Bell Services literally as soon as we got in the room right before I started this they're going to bring our cases up for us then we're going to get unpacked probably just lounge about for a bit maybe have a walk around at the resort I just realised that I've completely forgotten to do an outfit of the day so ears are from Once Upon a Craft UK shirt, best day ever from Kingdom Threads white Hollister shorts Powerpuff Girl socks and I wore my white Converse look, there's a little Disney rabbit is your name Thumper? It is a few hours later, we had a rest, we had a relax, we unpacked, Skyliner is just up 
there. We are going back to Magic Kingdom to go and see the nighttime show because we've not seen it. We want to see what it's like. Welcome to the Magic Kingdom. The return service to your resort hotel is available at this station. Be sure to ask your driver for the exact location. Smoking is not permitted at Magic Kingdom, except in the designated area outside the park entrance. So we're in the Magic Kingdom. In the confectionery shop, you can actually watch them when they make some of the treats. Oh, I see. If I had that job, I think I'd just eat everything. <laughs> oh, look at the precision. Okay, I know this is a little bit blurry. Change of plan. We're going to watch the fireworks from behind the castle and we're going to do the tangled lantern picture instead. Because um, we are going to come to Magic Kingdom another night so we can actually see the projection. So right now we're just going to kind of watch the fireworks from behind so that we can get the tangled picture in. So we've seen the fireworks, we've done the tangled photo shoot, which I'll pop a couple pictures up. There's a 50 minute wait for Peter Pan still, 10 minute wait for so It's a Small World, but we do not want that song in our head right before bed, thank you very much. So I think we'll just have a gentle, quiet walk out. Unless there's any other rides that are like 10 minutes, then we might hop on them, possibly. Here she is, it's about half past nine now and we're going to walk through the centre because that was closed earlier obviously it was light so that was different but still if you can walk through the castle oh, look this. do it oh. Ooh. you can see kind of sprinklers on the buildings shining shining brightly oh it's just beautiful isn't it there's probably a mass exodus for everyone kind of to get out right now so sometimes it's best to hang back 5 or 10 minutes to let the crowds kind of disperse oh lovely murals mosaics that's the word i was looking for mosaic but yeah just look at that main street usa oh my word there's quite a few people out there oh i feel like a princess walking through the castle <laughs> so we've just walked through the castle look at this isn't it absolutely stunning there's some slight projections on there. If I zoom in, you can probably see what I mean. It makes it look like little, little bits of pixie dust. Absolutely stunning. So it turns out that we took the Riviera bus because that one was a lot quieter than the Caribbean beach bus so we decided to pop into the Riviera really quick just to have a look around oh my goodness the smell in here is amazing I think I'm gonna need to ask somebody Le Petit Café I think I'm gonna need to ask somebody what is this smell and can I buy it oh look at this fancy balcony but yeah, it turns out that the Riviera bus got us here a lot quicker. Can we go down here and get out? Let's try. It feels too posh in here for us. Us mere muggles. Very fancy though. We considered DVC. Oh, I think I mentioned that earlier. We considered DVC here before. We very, very nearly did it. Oh, recreation. Where have we come out now? So we've just come through reception. Oh, over there where that blue part is, that's where that tangled mosaic is. So we've come out pretty much right in the middle. Oh, there's giant chess. Oh, even the floor is fancy. Blimey. Well, that was a good choice. We did a good little detour there, I think. Poshest detour ever. Look at this. It's beautiful. See that up there? I think up there. Well, it might be up there or somewhere else. 
up the top anyway is a very fancy character dining restaurant Topolino's and they're kind of decked out in their Riviera gear we've said we're tempted if we have enough coin and enough time then we might do that one because it's very close to us so we're back in the room it was definitely quicker to get the bus to Riviera and we might just do that from now on to be honest it depends which one arrives first but a little tip if you're in Caribbean Beach, depending where you are, we're in Aruba, it might be quicker to get the Riviera bus because there's only one stop for Riviera as well, whereas there's a few around Caribbean Beach. So, little tip there. Tomorrow is Hollywood Studios Day. We're going to build a lightsaber. Hopefully we'll be able to get on some of the rides like Rise of the Resistance. I love that one. We just managed to do that on our last trip and it was absolutely amazing. So thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.